friends, namaste, guten tag, bonjour, saurika, namaste. Uh, so this morning, 20 minutes, that's all, just 20 minutes of a yoga flow. Um, so be in the moment, just listen to your body, don't force anything, just go with the flow and be kind to yourself. If it doesn't feel right, then just come out of the pose or ease up on yourself. So just go gentle with yourself, enjoy the practice, listen to the music and we'll see you at the other end and have a beautiful day. So to start off with, we are going to start in extended child's pose. Okay, so if you if you just join me, um, <clears throat> just going to centre ourselves and just come onto your knees, sit onto your heels, and then we're just going to walk our hands down the mat and reach forward and extend, lengthen our spine. And just place your forehead on the mat and then just listen to the music or listen to the beating of your own heart uh, or your breath. But just calm yourself down and settle into the practice first. Just allow your body to sink into the mat, melt into the mat. Notice your breath as you inhale and exhale through the nose. If you've just joined me, we're just settling ourselves into the mat, extended child's pose. Just close your eyes and bring your senses inwards. Mind wanders, bring your focus back to the breath. Inhale, just bring your knees to about hip width apart. Come onto your knees. Going to do a few cat and cows just to loosen up the spine, warm up the spine. So release the belly, lift the heart, open the chest, breathe in. Exhale, curve the spine, press down with the hands. Into cat. Inhale, cow. Tucking the tailbone under, draw the belly in for cat. 
Follow the rhythm of your own breath. So inhaling to cow, looking up. Exhaling to cat. Don't forget the full range of motion you have with your spine. onto your heels, bring your body forward, elbows tucked in, lower your chest, slide along the mat, inhale cobra, squeeze the shoulder blades together, exhale, back up onto your knees, child's pose, again inhale come up, Lower the chest, chin, slide, inhale, cobra, exhale, come back to extended child's pose, reach forward, lengthen the spine, one more, lower, slide, inhale, Cobra, exhale, come onto your knees, bring your fingers wide, externally rotate the arms so your elbow crease is facing forward, tuck your toes under, we're going to go into downward dog, press into the fingerprints of your fingers, just raise your knees two or three inches first, and imagine you're being pulled to the ceiling by your hips. Take your tailbone to the sky, pressing back at the tops of your legs. Your spine's nice and long, and your neck's an extension of the spine. You can start walking the dog to stretch out the calf muscles. Stretching out one, one at a time. Come forward into plank. Just tucking the tailbone slightly to engage the core. Lower to your knees. Lower your chest, chin. Slide along the mat, inhale cobra. Exhale, come back into downward facing dog. Raise the right leg, sway your hips to the mat. Step between your hands. Rotate to the right. Place your neck where it's comfortable. Exhale, hands to the mat. Fold over the front leg. The front leg's nearly straight. Just a little bend in the front leg, so you feel a stretch in the hamstring. Send the breath to the hamstring as you inhale. Really tune into the area that's being stretched. Exhale, release, lower the knee, 
flatten the back foot. Then allow the body to sink deep into the mat. So the, your hips are going down and forward. Your knees still above the ankle. Facing forward, sweep the arms up, interlace the thumbs and breathe. Allow the weight of the body to sink into the mat. Really tune into your body, so listen, so you're not going to force anything, not straining anything. Just go where you're comfortable. And remember to breathe. Exhale, release, hands to the mat, tuck the back toe under, downward facing dog. Spread your fingers wide. Raise the left leg. Step between your hands. Knees above the ankle, rotate to the left and you just move your neck so it's nice and comfortable for you. And soften your face, remember to smile and breathe. Release, hands to the mat. Straighten the front leg, so you're folding over the front leg. Draw the left hip back. Again, a little micro bend in the knee. Send the breath to the hamstring as you inhale. Exhale, release, lower the right knee, untuck the foot. Allow the hips to sink down and forward and sweep the hands up, interlace the thumbs, arms are by your ears, really tune in to the area that's being stretched and don't force it, just allow the stretch to happen, be gentle on yourself, keep breathing. Exhale, release, hands to the mat, step to plank, hold in plank, engage the core, lower your knees, lower your chest and chin, slide along the mat, inhale, cobra. Exhale. Come back into downward facing dog. Raise the right leg. Step through to a high lunge. The back leg strong and straight. Knee directly over the ankle. Shoot the arms up. Gazing forward with a relaxed face. We're going to come on to one foot and then warrior three. So bring your weight forward, look forward, step forward, draw the knee up, the ankle up, hands in prayer position. 
Straighten the front leg. Focus on one spot for balance. Now option one, you can stay in this position. Or option two, you can tilt or cantilever your leg back. Straighten the arms, warrior three. Hold for three, two, one. Hands to the mat. Step back. Come into downward dog. Just going to do the other side. So raise the left leg. Step through. Knee directly over the ankle. Sweep the arms up. Relax the shoulders, arms by your ears. Sink an inch. Thigh parallel with the mat if possible. But you go where it's comfortable for you. Bring your weight forward. Come on to one leg. Draw the heel up. Hands in front of your chest. Focus on one spot for balance. Straighten the right leg. Just hold. Option one, just stay in this position. Option two, rotate the leg back, extend the arms into warrior three. for three, two, one, lower the arms, step back, come into plank, just hold in plank, now option one you can do knees, chest, chin, cobra, option two, chaturanga dandasana which is lowering into lowering the body down, not quite touching the ground, arms are parallel, come off the toes and then inhale upward facing dog. So just got the feet, backs of the feet on the mat. Don't want to crunch your shoulders either. Inhale, breathe. Exhale, lower the knees. Sit on the ankles. Just come into extended child's pose. Reaching forward. Place your forehead on the mat and close your eyes. So let everything go. Allow the weight of the body to sink into the mat. Into your breathing, and as you exhale, allow your body to go into a sense of deep relaxation.
with a few more breaths. stay in child's pose for as long as you like or you can come into a seated position to close Just keep your eyes closed bring your hands together in prayer position in front of your chest this morning. May peace go with you. Om Shanti. Thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed the practice. 20 minutes, just a little loosen up, get you set up for the day, not too much out of your normal time. So I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know, like, share with your friends. The video is going to go on to YouTube. It's Just Breathe Yoga with Ian Monday. All my videos are on there as well. And a lot of them include Wang Di, Thai Ridgeback. So thanks for joining me. See you tomorrow and have a beautiful day. The sun is shining here in Hampshire in England, wherever you are in the world. Okay, thanks.